Hi everybody, welcome to Tuesday. I hope your morning's going nicely. Here are the headlines. Of course, we continue to track Hurricane Ian. It has strengthened during the overnight hours. It is a big impact in the forecast for western Florida for wind and storm surge, but the entire peninsula could receive flooding amounts of rain. If you know anybody down there, please check in with them. Our local weather mainly quiet for the eight day forecast. There could be a minor pop up shower today and tomorrow in a couple of spots, but I think the headline is mainly quiet weather going through uh, the end of this week. So we're going to go with 70s today. Clouds giving way to more sun as the day goes by. And as I mentioned, there could be one or two random showers this afternoon. Most of the state will be dry. And these temperatures pretty close to where we should be for this time of the year. Now overnight tonight, pretty quiet 40s and 50s. Tomorrow, mostly dry random shower again, mainly inland western Connecticut. And we're looking pretty good Thursday, Friday with cooler temps. What's left of Ian will likely stay south of Connecticut, but we will get the clouds and some of that rain wants to come up to about Long Island later Sunday into Monday of early next week. So we have a lot of time to watch that, but the main core of what's left of wind would stay south of our area. I hope you have a great day today. And again, check in on the News 8 app, WTNH.com for the latest information on that hurricane. I'll see you tomorrow. Have a great day.